afternoon my loves welcome back so today I'm gonna to take you shopping with me first up we're gonna to go to Dior I just want to check out their new book tote which is in the canage and also the mini Dior book tote which came out a few months ago but I haven't seen I haven't been to Dior in a while actually but just quickly popping by to see my sales associate in Dior and then we're gonna go to High Point Shopping Center, which I haven't been to in ages. So Miss S and Sunshine are also out the back. But anyway, I will take you along and show you what I'm potentially thinking of in Dior. As you know, in my wishlist video, I am always searching for a small lady Dior bag, but it really depends on what they have. So I will catch you in a bit. <laughs> Okay, so I'm in Dior now. They're actually waiting for the new collections. So I guess the newest things is all the butterfly collection. Love the Lady Dior. Yeah, I haven't seen these shoes. I'm not sure if I'm a fan of that. I love pearls, but not sure about that one. The newest bag would be the Tajour bag, which is this one here. It comes in this size, and I've got the other size to try on for you guys. But it's a new leather, which is like a crinkled calfskin, I believe so it does open up i'll show you that in a bit and then we've got the g joy with the butterfly print and also a daylight whispering winds bring the remembrance that you're my girl no shame no games i want to Now I do really love the exotics, but these are so expensive. So beautiful though, look at this. And then more metallic -y shades. It's a little walk with the chain. And then this has got a chain as well, if you like just a crossbody pouch sort of thing. So it looks like that. Okay, so this is the newest bag, which is the Tajour bag. And this is in the small size. It comes in three sizes and I'll show you all of them. And this is in calfskin leather. It comes in black, white, and a camel, I believe. See how one side, the strap is longer. You can actually shorten it so it's adjustable. And then there's got two closures here. One here to nip in the bag and another closure here too. So, if you extend it out this way, you can wear it like underneath your arm, though it's probably slightly tight. So I think it looks better this way. And the mechanism is just like this. Make the thing shorter, you just pull it. So this is brand new bag. <laughs> so it will, the leather will soften up. <laughs> Perfect, thank you so much. Wow. Yes. Thank you. And then just a quick size comparison. This is the small versus the medium. So that's the medium. And that's what it looks like. So the large is really big. More like a never full size. That's what it looks like. What do you guys like better? The large? Just do it all together. Medium or small? Okay, finally had a chance to try on the mini book tote, which is so much better than the previous one because it comes with a strap. I love that it's got proper handles and not the flat handles. But for me, I just want it in a different color because I already own the oblique in the large size. So that's what it looks like on me. Very, very cute actually. I do like it. And then this is the small, this is the size I'm after, but not in this print. There's nothing wrong with this print, but I'm just waiting for a design to come out that I would actually like. Now, I actually don't mind the new Dior book tote in the canage leather, but it only comes in white, gray, and black at this stage. And I don't think I need another light colored bag. And then of course the medium, which I love, but I already own this size. This is in the newest butterfly print. 
but I have this already as you know I got this last year which I absolutely adore so just as a quick size comparison this is mine this is the medium and then this is the small Here are some of the ready to wear. Look at this pink. I like this classic bar jacket in the pink. Lots and lots of butterflies. Beautiful. And also in the shirt. It's very classic look with the collar. Okay, I like this detail all along this edge of this sort of boucle skirt, the little tee. Oh, this, this knit's quite cute. Long. Wow, this skirt's really thick. Beautiful butterfly design carried through into the Lady Dior. This knit jacket, which I've tried on before in a blue. Yes, I think because uh, Lunar New Year is the dragon, so that's why they've got some dragon. Okay, just trying on this Dior jacket. Love the crop style. Love the pearl buttons. What do you guys think of the color? Too bold? Fits really well. I just don't know if I'll get that much wear out of purple, but it is a nice vibrant color. All right, this is a trunk show piece, but this will be coming very comfortable. So it's got the canage, kind of looks like tweed. Yeah, I quite like this too. Skirt is very comfortable, so it looks like that. And then this is like sort of like a cardigan, coatigan. I don't know, I actually think I like the purple better. I mean, this is more classic though. I think I would get one wear out of this, but that purple surprised me. So this is the Misty Your bag. They've brought it back. I remember I used to own something like this. So previously they had the one in the wok and now they've made it into a bag. I mean, it's cute, but I don't know, I still prefer the Lady Dior, but it is a cute bag if you want. I mean, I like that you can hold it like that too. Hubby just spotted these, they're Dior men's sneakers, I don't know the name, but I really like them. Would you get them hubs? They're called, yeah, they look like dunks, they should be like Dior dunks. Here are some of the patent DJs, that's nice in the lace. This is the lizard in blue in the mini, very cute. I like this mini alligator in the metallic super expensive it's like 37,500 but the finish is absolutely divine okay guys we've arrived to high point super excited to let you know that I'm heading to the Vayas pop-up store I'm gonna head in I've introduced you to this brand before so comfortable their shoes so it's really exciting that they have a store here in Melbourne. Stay tuned, they're gonna have a permanent store soon. But let me flip the camera around and show you what I'm seeing. Okay, so here is the store. It is a smaller store, but it is a pop-up. So let me show you some of their range. So this is one of their most popular styles, which is the Aria. And did you know that with Vivea, what's super innovative about them is all their uppers and materials, they actually recycle plastic bottles and make it into their thread. So they're very big on sustainability. All their flats, you can actually throw in the washing machine and wash them. They're bendable, as you can see. 
so just super comfortable i will try them on but they've got a range of colors and since i've introduced you to them i love that they've got this is the same shoe but this is the walker star so can you see inside it's got a bit more padding and i'm telling you it feels light as a feather all right so i've got the manager here with me emily and with the aria is i'm not sure if i said it right but the difference between the aria and the aria walker is that the insole is more padded is that correct yeah, that's let's have true. do a comparison yeah and then what else is the difference then, is that outside like, also, yeah insole and outsole is mm -hmm. different they look exactly the same yeah but the walker series is much lighter it's much lighter yeah. and so why do more people buy this one or this one um it's really depends on the person mm -hmm. if you look like walking a lot person i'll always recommend to get the walker series really yeah. these will be good for travel shoes won't they yeah exactly, yeah, yeah. Okay, another super popular style is the Margot. This is the 2.0 version, but it comes in different widths. So if you've got a wider foot, you are going to love these because they cater from anywhere from like a C fitting to a double E. And again, they've also got it in the Walker range. So Miss S is actually trying on some shoes. She likes the Margot. It looks so cute on her. And then they've got the one with the strap as well. So Emily, can I ask you, this is the C width, right? And then they've got two other widths, is that correct? Yes. So Miss S has wide feet, so mm -hmm. I love that these shoes, mm -hmm. it's almost like they're customized for you because you've got different fits. Another great thing is that they've got half sizes. Actually, the square toe really suits her and she loves her flats. I'm just so excited that they're in Australia now and they've got some of the boots I love their boots I own this one which I wear so much in brown and I'm actually thinking of trying I really I really like this you can't go wrong with just a classic ankle boot so I'm gonna try some styles on they've got some runners you can't go wrong with runners some sort of like loafers so this is called the Michelle oh I love these love 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 these you know what these remind me of guys Dior right I love the pointed shape and this is very Chanel-esque. I do own something similar, but it's nice having a round toe. Sometimes it's nice having a point. You've got your square, round, and this is just, what style is this? I don't even know. This is called the Melody Pro. And oh, what's this one? Oh, this is the wedge version. So it's good that they've got different constructions. Okay, I'm trying on the Ryan boots. So comfortable. I love the color of them. Do you know what color reminds me of? It reminds me of Hermes Atoupe. Please excuse the lighting. Oh my goodness, guys. I'm in love with these. I think I want these in every color. Okay, totally give me Dior vibes. And it's just got a very, very little kitten heel. Oh my gosh, it's so comfortable. So I'm wearing it in a 38. Probably could fit in a 38, uh, 37 and a half, but I prefer it slightly looser. So Emily just told me that they've got a few bow designs, so you can just clip on a bow, can't yeah, you? Yeah, can Oh, I love it, so cute. You've got another pair of shoes. Yeah, you got two in, like two in one, right? I love it. This, this gives me more of like a Ferragamo vibe. It's like Dior and Ferragamo. Guys, I have such a similar pair, well, my Chanel pair, and look at these ones. See, if the shoe fits, buy multiple colors, right? I think with the toe cap, it just makes it look so classy. What do you guys like better? The cream with the black toe cap or the oil of the black? Comment below. Okay, you know how I told you guys I'm not normally a flat person? These flats might make me change my mind because they are so flattering. I prefer these over Chanel ballets. I don't own any Chanel ballets, but these are really, really comfortable. As you can see, it's got the toe cap. It's got the netting breathability, but best of all, it's so nice to know that each of the shoes are made out of recycled plastic bottles. So it's very good for the environment. And then if you guys prefer a round toe, go with this. Good block heel, again, love the black toe cap. 
and this is called the Julie Pro. So guys, I am really excited to let you know that they have given me the highest code again. Yes, I had to ask, but you guys loved the discount code last time, so just use my code below. I'll put it on screen here, and but it's only valid for 72 hours. on looking at me like that and you don't know what you do to me and so yes i already own the jade i own it in pink and a very similar color to this but if you want something a little bit different there's a little bit more classic then of course the juliet's gorgeous as well like this is beautiful I mean, I love a little bit of netting detail. I just think it makes the shoe look more expensive. And this is what I mean. All the different colored bows where you can use it as options for the shoe, making it like a two-in-one. We're just having a little walk around now. Oh, I see Aj there. They also have Polo, Dior, Dior Beauty, and then they've got Tommy Hilfiger here, Guess, David Jones. Yeah, some really nice stores here too. Okay, I'm gonna take a quick look at Aj, which is one of my favorite Australian designers. So let's go in and take a look at this beautiful dress with the ruffles I'm always just looking out I have two weddings this year they've got some really nice casual outfits but also oh this little play suits cute I like that how much is that it's 425 little mini skirt rosettes a lot of things with rosettes a lot of red, this with all the, what's this, oh it's sort of raffia detail down the bottom, shirt, it's very big skirt, okay guys this is one of their large dresses, I just love their fit, it just, I don't know, it makes it look a little bit slimmer, love the button detail which is very age. I mean another one of my dresses have that and then just like the sort of like sweetheart neckline and then this is the pink what do you guys prefer pink or black Hey guys, I realized I never ended the vlog. So this is a couple of days later and I wanna show you the shoes that I picked up from Vivea cause I was waiting for a couple of them to come in. I'm actually on my way to pick up Miss S and I'm wearing, well, this one isn't new but I wanted to show you what I'm wearing as well. And then also show you these goodies. So let me just flip the camera around and show you what I'm wearing. Okay, so I'm just wearing denim shorts that I was wearing the other day in the vlog. Love these. This is my Zimmerman blouse, which I own a lot of colors, my Slavorsky earrings, and these gorgeous boots. So these boots I absolutely adore. They are so comfortable. They really remind me of the Hermes ankle boots, but at a fraction of the cost. I already own them in chocolate, and I always get compliments when I wear them. I couldn't walk all day in these. And it just goes with everything. Perfect for fall, perfect for spring. Then if you look at my entire look, it just goes effortlessly. Now let's get to what's in those bags.
Really excited to show you this first pair. These are the Aria block heels, but what makes this special is, can you see that the heel is clear? You know, I love my clear shoes, but I just love this heel detailed. Plus, block heels make a shoe so much more comfortable. So this shoe comes in four colors. I really liked the black, but I ended up picking another pair of shoes in black. Also, it comes in navy and a gorgeous cream color. So I think these are great block heel pumps and the detail just makes it that little bit more fashion forward. So I especially love the Bordeaux and I'll be actually wearing this to another Lunar New Year dinner. So this was a super obvious choice. I had to get the Scarlet Pointed Toe Kitten Heels. I also grabbed a pack of their detachable bows because they're so versatile and it's like two shoes for the price of one. You can also use these bows on your other shoes as well and it just slips on and off. So it's super versatile. Great heel height, so comfortable. It also does come in five colors and they've added a new pressure relief sole into this. It really reminds me of the Dior Slingbacks, but this is only 139 USD and then you can use MIM 18 to get 18% off. This would make the perfect work shoe or just the perfect mid-size heel you can walk all day in. Yes, I love the Scarlet shoes so much. I did end up getting them in the ivory with the black toe cap. Little details I forgot to mention, all Vivea shoes have an anti-slip sole. It's got a cushioned heel counter to prevent blisters, arch support. So all those details is what makes this so comfortable. And for me, I didn't find there was any break in time. It's actually so similar to one of my favorite heels, which are my Chanel's. But the Chanel's obviously cost over a thousand dollars and these are just a fraction of the price. And this is Miss S with her new pair of Margot flats. She loves them. And doesn't she look cute in them? So I highly recommend for you to check out Vivea. Their shoes are so comfortable, but they're also so stylish. Don't forget to use my code MIM18 to get 18% off site-wide. I hope you enjoyed this shopping vlog and the mini haul. Thank you so much for watching. Have a fabulous day or night, and I will see you in my next video. Bye, guys.